If you want to improve your market returns, uh, watch uh, this video. Because I will explain how you can increase your productivity in uh, stock picking. Uh, and it is super easy and uh, you have to do only two things. Uh, first of all, uh, you have to analyze what uh, sectors uh, growing faster than other and why. I hope you already saw this uh, beautiful uh, uh, Google spreadsheet uh, and it is uh, 43 stocks uh, to buy for a long term and uh, the main criteria is that they are growing and uh, uh, they have uh, some competitive advantage. If we will check them uh, you will see a uh, lot of uh, information technology companies like Apple, Microsoft, Alphabet, uh, Facebook, uh, Visa, uh, Intel uh, and uh, lots of uh, healthcare companies like Johnson & Johnson, Abview, Bristol-Myers, Nova Nordisk, Amgen, Intuitive Surgical, uh, GlaxoSmithKline uh, and other. I'm buying healthcare because uh, you will pay everything uh, to survive uh, and uh, it is a little bit sad uh, but uh, if you have options uh, to sell your house and uh, live for the next uh, 20 years uh, or not to sell your house and uh, die in two months, 99% uh, that you will choose the first one. And I'm investing in information technology or IT companies uh, uh, because you can just check YouTube stats uh, and uh, on similar web uh, you can see 35 billion total visits uh, per month, <laughs> average visit duration 20 minutes uh, and only 21% from the United States. If you're focusing on IT company and uh, you're working globally, uh, definitely on a long term you can make uh, more money than uh, a local restaurant. You can find unreal amount of data on this team, but uh, Fidelity 5 years, uh, information technology plus 244%, uh, consumer discretionary uh, plus 124%, uh, financials plus 100% uh, and healthcare plus 78%. Uh, but I like uh, this website a little bit more, uh, barchart.com slash stock slash market performance. Uh, and uh, you can see one year performance uh, and uh, it looks like uh, you have to buy uh, consumer distractionary companies uh, uh, but uh, if you move it to a little bit bigger time frame uh, you can see that information technology is a uh, number one and then we have uh, consumer discretionary uh, and uh, on the third place, uh, healthcare. I'm uh, trying not to focus uh, my mind on other sectors because uh, uh, you wouldn't uh, get uh, income uh, higher than S&P 500 index uh, and I think it's just a wasting of uh, your time. If you will check uh, consumer discretionary holdings, uh, uh, you will see that uh, they are holding Amazon, uh, Booking Holdings, uh, uh, Etsy uh, and uh, from my point of view, it is uh, super close to information technology. Maybe that is why this uh, ETF uh, perform really nice. And if I will check uh, healthcare, you can see FView, Amgen, uh, Biogen, uh, Biorat Laboratories, Bristol Myers and other companies uh, from my list again. If you're buying something uh, from uh, utilities, uh, energy, real estate, materials, uh, uh, please uh, write down your thoughts in the comment section below uh, why are you doing it. Uh, thank you for watching, uh, don't forget to subscribe, see you later, bye bye.